Mm-hmm. Yeah, I would fight him, but it wouldn't be about the money. For me, it's about proving to all the younger brothers out there that you don't have to be in the shadow of your older brother. And I think I would fight him just because I want to prove everyone wrong. I think most people would think that, I mean, maybe after, not after tonight, but I think most people would think that he would beat me because he's bigger. He looks more ripped, but I'm a real dog. And he, he can catch that smoke eventually, but I love him to death. So it's a weird kind of thing to talk about, <laughs> but you know, maybe we'll grow up. Maybe it won't happen. Maybe, maybe a year from now, I'll change my mind. So I don't know. I'm 23 and make stupid decisions and I am as mature as I, <laughs> you know, so like, <laughs> who knows what'll happen. My career, my career goal was to do exactly what I did, is to have an undeniable victory and steal the show and prove to the boxing world who has doubted me for the past six months that, like, I'm a pro boxer and I'm here to stay. And when you put those 10 ounce gloves on me, I'm vicious. I can hit. I'm a real dog. And when these MMA fighters come into the ring, they're, <laughs> they're going to meet the problem, child. They're, they're going to meet me. And, and I'm here to make millions of dollars and sell millions of pay-per-view. I'm here to be one of the biggest stars. I think I might just be the new Floyd. I mean, I box for like six to eight hours a day. And I make music like once a month. <laughs> But whenever I get in the studio, shit, I, that's one of my pat. You know, that's what I'm saying. I'm forfeiting a lot to box, so we'll see. I might, I'm gonna keep on putting out songs because it's it's what I love to do. Like I'm gonna wake up tomorrow, Sunday, and and the way my mind works is I'm just gonna be like, okay, what do I, what am I doing next? I gotta go. I gotta work hard. So. I don't think I have to. I'm the money man now. <laughs> I call the shots now. I'm A side always now. It's seven figures all the time now. Maybe eight figures too. Shit. I think it's eight figures now. <laughs> yeah, it is, right? <laughs> yeah, it's eight figure. It's I'm the eight figure kid now. Uh but I mean shit. You never know what's gonna happen. If you told me Two or four years ago, if I'd be knocking out Nate Robinson on Mike Tyson undercard at a boxing match, I'd be like, "What? I'm on. I'm a Disney Channel actor. What are you talking about?" So four years from now, who knows? Anything could happen. It's 2020. Thank you, guys.